So what we got, folks, is Ford Raptor. Going too fast, around the curb, lost control. Went off cliff. So it's leaning up against a tree. I haven't seen any pictures or anything. So, But supposedly this thing is teetering on the edge of destruction. So we're going to go find out right now. We're going to take old Black Betty here because supposedly it's off-road. We're going to try out our side puller. Something a little heavier than a Toyota Corolla or whatever that was we did last Ford Fusion. Stand by, folks. Well, folks, we made it out here. We made it to the dirt road. We're in route. We're gonna head down here and winch this old uh, Ford Raptor out. It's starting to rain. It's a little chilly tonight, huh, boys? Oh, uh, camper. It's elk season right now, folks. So, so the campers are out. Well, folks, the coordinates they gave us were not right, so we are on a wild goose chase. We have no cell signal. We're gonna go check a little place up here where people drift off the drift off the main road and uh, see if they're there. We'll let you know how it goes. So stand by. Actually, you know, I think we found. Them. I, I, I heard somebody said they just pulled a big dually out of here like a week ago. I mean, it looks like I'm like leaning against a tree up there. I kind of just slid right into it. Yeah. Uh, no airbags, nothing like that. You can't really get to the other side and look because it's pretty steep and it's really loose. Right. Um, the good thing is, it's not terribly damaged. That. We'll run the side puller to the back bumper and then we'll run this back to the front wheel right there. See if we can't drag her on up out of there. Uh, if not, we may have to go get rid of the truck. It's pretty steep, folks. I mean, the camera's probably not doing it justice, but it's almost vertical. The only thing holding it up is a tree. Oh. You're damn near whoops. Excuse me. Shots fired. Shots fired. Balls in there. After driver's <laughs> cork. You see those whoops? How many TRX recovery videos do we have? Huh? <laughs> Luckily that tree stopped him.
the old bowling you know, just run an anchor line so when we start pulling we're going to run double winch lines and we're going to reduce them we're going to run uh, double and back snatch blocks uh, complements of yanking and this is a an anchor point so it doesn't pull black betty here off that down in there with it so it's going to be a really hard pull I know what you're thinking, folks. You know, why not bring the rotator out? This is a piece of cake job for the rotator. Well, because we don't like to drive the rotator in dirt road. You know, except for the one time we went and got the BNSF. BNSF truck. Uh, so, this is what you're getting. A little Black Betty action, a little side puller action. And I didn't know it was this bad. You know, uh, I'm pretty I thought dangerous. It, I thought it, yeah. I didn't know it was this steep and this big of a drop off. And I pulled trucks out here before, but uh, it looked like it's further back. And I didn't know we had these boulders here, so I just kind of think it's going to be a piece of cake walking the park. We'll bring back Black Betty, but we probably should have brought a bigger truck. I mean, y'all don't watch us because we do, you know, the easy way. So stand by. Give me a little more or do I need to come pull it? That's good. We got our Bailey's slings here. Nothing but the best, folks. Uh, I always check your equipment first. Getting a little, getting a little worn there. I'm not gonna lie, but they've been through a lot. You know, a lot of hard pulls. Let me have a, I'm gonna double up the slings on this, Tay. Let me have another sling. See what you want, folks. You want this nice coating around there. Cause these rims are sharp right there, so. Sliding looks good. It's almost like standing on top of it working. Mm -hmm. What do you think, folks? Should we let the air out of the tires and drive it out? Huh? Is this one rigged? They'll probably still say that. Probably. That's a Raptor. I would have just drove it out. You could have just drove it out. How about some light, bro? Oh. <coughs> All right, take Go pull the winch tight. Snug it up. One thing about these folks is they're, they're pretty cool, is these winch rings, they're offset, they're really big too. I really like these. What? Yeah, so got our Bailey slings, rigged up with some Yankum winch rings. All right, go ahead. What a combination, huh? Whoa, she's already trying, trying to come out. Jesus. <laughs>
Well, we made it, huh, folks? How about that, huh? That's quite the drop there. Y'all thought it... Y'all were thinking it wasn't going to be able to do it, weren't you? Look at that. See how far it goes all the way? There's a pickup that went straight off of it right there. Down to the bottom. I drug yeah. it up there one time. It's right there, I think, yeah. actually. A couple of feet either way, and it would have been a very, yeah. very long fall sideways. Yeah, there's been a couple that I've pulled out of here. Is that, is that your handiwork? Or somebody else's handiwork? Where's that? It just looked like something else got yanked out. Yeah, I can't remember if it was right there. It went all the way down, and it was uh, like on the rocks, and a tree was holding it up. All, all the way down? Yeah. How did yeah. you get him back out? Just drag him back out of there. Slowly I got a bigger here, truck, like... yeah. Well, his truck was totaled, so there wasn't, we didn't have to be too careful. Yeah, that's true. So it was pretty wiped out, but. Boy, that is handy. I'll tell you what, I do love those fair leads, folks. We do like these racks. We kind of do these recoveries for fun. Yeah. The big recoveries <laughs> that we do. But well, serious, I would like. Uh, that's this is pretty much all we do for fun. We, I don't have you know any side by sides. I buy wreckers and and build off road rigs and yeah. and that's like all we do. For, you're, you're like Arizona's match recovery, really. <laughs> yes, sir. You guys are out yep. here killing it. And we do, uh, but we really work. Our main deal is big recoveries on the highway, big that's semi wrecks. He was saying. And Huge. I got three rotators, and I got three uh, rotators. They all they're between sixty and eighty thousand pounds. And I don't know how you move that much weight around like that. It just seems you just like that amazing geometry rigging. <laughs> you know, and careful planning and yes, sir. And staying yeah. way out of the way yeah. and being careful and taking your time and. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, and, and, but yeah, no, we, everything we use, we don't try not to damage it at all, so, you know, that's the point, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and yeah, we'll you people like me really appreciate that. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, we do it all the time. We, we that's pull them out. It's unfortunate that you have to yeah. do it all the time. Well, you know what? The, um, get all the Phoenix people. Like, it's nice. <laughs> well, I mean, at least, like, we get calls for for guys, right. you know, that'll be on one of these back roads. And, I mean, it'll be just, the the roads will be barely even slick. And their uh, tires will have 80 pounds of air because that's what the sidewalls call for. And and they can't go anywhere. And we'll go out and let the air out of them and, and you know, <laughs> teach them, out. you know. There's yeah. a lot of people. We don't get these ones like this very often. You know, um, really. Well, full disclosure: I'm aired down, so yes, let's, get that, let's get that out. <laughs> yeah. I still, I mean, nearest we're we can down, figure. Down to 45, is that what you're about? Yes, <laughs> but this, <laughs> these, look at those washboards. Yeah. Yeah. They look like whips. They look like dirt bike whips. You know. Yeah.
Well, folks, there's raptors everywhere, folks. Uh, they got a raptor off-road club. These things are pretty legit, let me tell you. Might have to get me a Ford Raptor, folks. And just like that, they were gone. Where was it? On me somewhere. Look at that thing. This thing is huge. It's not a tarantula. What is it? It's a uh, wolf spider. That is not a wolf That's a wolf spider? Isn't it? No, it's yeah. a tarantula. Chucker, it looks like a big old wolf spider. Look at his front little things. It's a tarantula. It's a tiny tarantula. Raptors and spiders out here, folks. We could only find a rattlesnake now. Well, folks, we made it back. Got those raptors back to blacktop. Now we're gonna get loaded up and hit the blacktop ourselves. Well, folks, we're calling it a night. It's not a cookie. That's a cream. You find that on the floor? No, it was in It's legit. It was in his bag. It's right there on the floor, huh? I don't know where it went. Huh. But, uh, I don't know about y'all, but I was thoroughly impressed by Black Betty. I was also impressed. Everybody's saying that thing wouldn't hold and the pipe was too weak and haters. And the side puller? Yeah. I'll tell you what. Um, you could hear that thing creaking and moaning and groaning. Like uh, that, I mean, that side puller got put to the test, folks. You know, those 12,000 pound winches were like at their limit. And they were snatch blocked, so you know um, they weren't. I didn't have them run all the way out, so we had a couple layers on the drum, but uh, they were definitely hard pulls. Uh, once again, you know, I'd like to thank Bailey's for their phenomenal slings and uh, Yankum. I was pretty impressed with Yankum tonight. Um, those links that like those long ones it's like a 8 foot link or 10 foot link that thing was freaking dope the winch rings those things are are legit too uh, we need to get two more two more of them so on those pools we could have ran their 5 part system front and rear on that that would have been legit. That thing would have freaking pulled so easy. Those winches anyway. But would have put, put a lot of pressure on the truck still, but. And there were raptors everywhere, folks. You know, let me tell you. Arizona Raptor Off-Road Club? Is that what it was called? Yeah, yeah. I pulled that, where that Raptor went off, I pulled a lot of trucks out of there. Um, I mean, those washboards, you all see in the washboards, I mean, they, they're they deep. I mean, those washboards are probably six six inches deep, you know. Uh, and you come around there, come hauling ass around that corner, 
and sometimes there's another person coming around the corner. Happens all the time, you know. Um, He's lucky that tree was there. Yeah, yeah, that tree freaking saved his ass. You stay classy, Raptor Convoy. <laughs>